hello! Welcome to welcome to part 30 of Let's Play Banjo Kazooie. Yes. So here we are in the final level. Again, hopefully we'll actually uh, achieve more than we did last time because last time we didn't achieve all that much. Shit. And that is a little representation of just how little we have achieved. Yeah, I mean, we've got a couple of Jinjos, we've got some notes, obviously, but, uh... Yeah, we've yet to get a Jiggy, and until we get a Jiggy, it doesn't really feel like you're making all that much progress, does it? And, oh, I'm sorry, this is disgraceful that I haven't got a Jiggy left, it should not be take... I mean, I have not got a Jiggy yet, it shouldn't take as long. I think the main problem was that I just... suck at this game. It's uh, because... Um... I, uh, switched to the B too quickly, and, yeah, I, I was just like, oh, yeah, B, fun, 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 not really thinking about how, oh, see, there aren't too many Jiggies you can get in the way of b -ness. it's better to just stick as Banjo Kazooie until you can actually use the B for much, I mean, it's nice to, uh, get around easier, but, friggin' heck, if you're spending time, you could, you could be spending, collecting actual jiggies. So hopefully, you know, may maybe I wouldn't have, um, maybe I would have actually got a jiggy in the last part if I just hadn't fallen off a tree. It happens, okay? The tree is a bit treacherous. I'm finding myself losing a lot of health in this uh, stage. I was absolutely positive that I was going to fall there. Just thought I'd let you know. Well, I don't think I need any dual service because I have been. Yeah, yeah, I have been stocking up. I've yet to uh, waste any since. That was extremely treacherous. <laughs> 69. Yeah. I'm sorry, but the the fucking camera in this game it, it isn't very good, is it? Okay, wait, shall I unlock Summer? There's nothing you can do to stop me, Peter Pan. Actually, there might be, because it's frozen me in place. Am I going to attack? Yep, yeah, that, that is so unfair! That is, I think, I think I'm in the right when I say that is quite fucking bullshit. Fuck you. So I figure I'll be a bit, thank you camera, a bit topical, and um, speak about recent developments in the YouTube world. Yeah, YouTube won, man. I mean, yeah, I've made a comparison before, but it, it does seem a bit of a coincidence, a bit of a strange, suspicious coincidence. We have the Xbox One, which is extremely crap, and we have the YouTube One channel design, which is extremely crap. Yeah, you better collapse. It is a very tragic time. Yes, yeah, so unfortunately we've reached a point where everybody has now been forced to adopt the new channel design. I just... You know, I... Oh, for goodness. <laughs> oh, that is the worst place to land. I was, I was like shifting away from the tree because I didn't want to fall. I wanted to fall in water. I suck, I'm sorry. Okay, hopefully... My third fucking attempt won't be so bad. But yeah, you know, the banner idea, it isn't bad. It isn't bad. And, you know, a lot of people have done good things with the banners. And you can do good things with the banners. I mean, I've heard, like, the resolutions, like, the minimum resolution is, like, ridiculous and stuff. But, you know, the idea of a banner isn't bad. I've seen some good ones. But forcing you to have a banner and forcing you to not have a background? Are you fucking kidding me? What, what if I want a background, or what if I just want my channel to not look completely white before In fact, no, you can't, you can't, you have to have it completely white now. It's like, oh, what, who needs a background? Who needs a bit of colour to the channel page? All the colour's just gonna be on that one little banner. But why can't we have the option to have both a background and a banner? Or not a banner? And so, oh no, you're having that banner. We're having a fucking ugly grey rectangle for the rest of your life. 
So, but it really, that, that's your default? How about you just not show up the banner until I choose something for it? And, oh god, it's so ridiculous, because my background's fucking awesome. And now it's gone, it's just like, oh sorry, sorry you can't have that anymore, we're taking that away from you. So, um, but, but I, I don't want you to, it's my channel. Not anymore, bitch. Yeah, this, this is horrible. Oh, I'll have to change my about information as well, because like... If, if I'm assuming you can still see about information, I'm assuming they didn't take that away too. Because that mentions the background, it's like, what background? We don't have a background in YouTube anymore, this is a new age. This is how we're doing things, bitch. <sighs> yeah, I, I hate YouTube. I'm sorry, I hate them. In fact, I'm not even sorry, I just hate them. A lot. But I guess I'll get some form of banner eventually. But... <sighs> You know, I'm tempted to just make my banner just like other people have done and say this new layout sucks, but whatever. But... Oh, for... I can't believe it. I can't believe it. Excuse me while I cry. You know, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm going to be a bit cheap. I mean, this is just back from where I was in the beginning of the part, so hopefully that's not too... Okay, it is pretty horrendous. And look, I'm doing this for the sake of entertainment. You don't want to see me redo the whole level, do you? This level is pretty hard. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be fair. It's like how many? Oh yeah, I've got zero jiggies here. Okay, once I get four jiggies, I'm tempted to just say I'm out because yeah, this level is pretty, pretty ridiculous. I mean, it's, it's like a good idea for a level, all that jazz, but when you die here, it's especially bad because four different areas and you're gonna have to redo everything you did in all those four areas all over again. I mean I know I hadn't actually been on any of the four areas left but like there's still that effect of the, the scope of this level and how you have to redo it all. Anyway let's continue to rant about YouTube 1 shall we. So it's like sometimes it just doesn't fit at all it's like yeah Everyone wants a banner, don't they? So let's just stick you with this grey banner until, uh, until um, you're ready to give yourself one. Oh my god, what the fuck is going on? It's like, yeah, okay. I don't, I don't really think Marble Hornets is a very uh, bannery channel, and I like how uh, I won't say the specific example, but another Slenderman series. It's because I don't want to spoil. You know, it's the channel of a dead character, and now that background for them is gone. So, like, they can't get that background back, they're dead. It wouldn't make sense for them to have a banner, so we... Oh, just... There's, there's just so many things wrong with it on so many levels, and they haven't considered a single one, and... all well, they did, and they just don't give a shit. They're just like, we're gonna do what we want. We want pretty banners, and we want everyone to have them. Oh, yeah, this is fucking treacherous, look at this. I am getting tempted to use save states endlessly, but I'm not gonna. Almost hoping something forces me to end this part just so I can save state sooner. Oh yeah, I forgot that doesn't work for some reason. We're gonna get a G for God's sake. No, I think that's all to do in here in this season at least. I'd say that Jiggy was well earned. Oh yeah, nothing but extra lives, which I'm sorry, but I don't care much about. Why do I keep on saying I'm sorry, but it's like, it's like a habit for a lot of people. It's like turned around and said, I'm sorry, but I'm sorry, but I'm sorry, but why are you sorry? It's like that after a while. When you keep on saying it, there are times when you're going to say it when really, why are you sorry at all? And I forgot to brief free the eagle. Oh no! No! God damn it! God damn it! I'm sick of this level. <laughs> it's so easy to fall off a tree. You take so much goddamn damage when you do so, and then you have to climb back up. I know by memory that uh, that bird is dead. Because I have to go that same way so many times. I might just leave after getting four jiggies because you need quite a lot of jiggies to complete the game. You need 94, so 
there are 100 Jiggies in total, 9 worlds and Grunty's Lair. So, you know, if there's a world you particularly are having trouble with, you can just get 4 of the Jiggies and back out, but you'll need all the Jiggies in the other areas. So, there's not much leniency, but there is a little, for one level at least. Definitely a level I'd say. Actually, I'm not sure. <laughs> I was going to say the level where you're most afraid of dying, but well, now it's trying to convince me of that. But there is also um, Rusty Bucket Bay with the fucking infamous engine room. <sighs> you know, I think I'd have been pretty scared if I wasn't such a save, save state whore at the time. Yeah, you know, it's all very well and good. I'm like breezing through this game, I'm like, oh yeah, look at me, but I keep on safe saying, so I'm sorry. Yeah, I don't, I don't know how many times I'll have fallen off this tree by the time we're done in this level. Even if I get all 4 Gs, I mean, I mean, if I just get 4 Gs and leave, I might come back afterwards. Yeah, I probably will. I probably will. I really should. Just for, you know, completion's sake for Let's Play. Like, I might complete the main game and then just finish off stuff in here. It's like, I'm not going to save state core anymore, I'm going to gonna stick to my morals, and it's just like, come on, come on, go back to how you were, and it's just like, I don't know, but I really should, I'm getting tempted, as I know that I'll die more and more, more than I already have, I mean, I've just died once, but it's such a heavy toll, especially, yeah, okay, that, that's another big thing, because you keep on falling off a tree anyway, even while you're alive, and if you die, that's just like, Falling off a tree times a billion. We know we've seen you. Right, so I believe I've done everything I can for now here. Actually, I might have just straight up done everything I can, so let's go. Very uh, precariously go. I might jump down into that once I'm able to. summer because I'm sick of this fucking spring shit. How much health do we even have? Not a lot. Okay, thankfully I've left this here. And I also have this available. I'm sure there's honey scattered elsewhere. It would be a bit precarious getting here. I could die just trying to. You can't just like, walk around this level like you can others. You have to fucking jump up a tree to get around. Now Rusty Bucket was kind of similar. But I think, yeah, the levels just get more treacherous to navigate as you go along, I think. Yeah, they're all starting out rather linear. Rust Bucket Bay, you have to, like, jump from section to section, avoiding toxic water and stuff. And then, at this point, you've got all these four different areas, and you have the fucking tree to deal with. At any rate... And how many notes do we have here? 20. Not enough. I think it is enough, but I think it is the bare minimum you need actually, if you have 20 here. So, let's see. Yeah, I think, I think that is the bare minimum that you need. I mean, it's in your best interest to get as many as you can, but this should suffice. Memory serves. Speaking of notes.
Can I get up without getting my ass kicked? I can't even get up at all, so. Well, there's something we can do over here. Fortunately, we've got full health, so we're not in too much peril right now, but that could easily change at a moment's notice. Will you die, you motherfucker? Also, I like how all the water practically is dried up, but, you know, people are actually alive. Let's help this guy out. Man, ah, so generous to the Mumbo Tokens now that I don't need them anymore. Yeah, I'm going to stop pointing out the Mumbo Tokens, it's a bit old. Yeah, as you can see, you can't get up here. I'm not even sure it's theoretically possible. You know, I don't really know why they don't just ask for him to come down and help. But, whatever. You'll have to wait until later to get up there. But I was running and waiting until another season! Zoom out! <laughs> oh, I don't mind if I do. <laughs> I believe this is where another one of the switches are, is even. Oh, yep. Yeah. So pretty early on. Okay, I'm, I think I might actually just go to this one now because I, I think that's the one with the most notes. Then again, I'm not too afraid of death. I I should get those caterpillars, but oh man, man, that's risky. That's risky indeed. Do I go get the notes now, or do I stay here and risk losing quite a bit of health? Find out next time! Which is just an excuse for me to save state here so that I can do the other option if one doesn't work out so well for me. Goodbye!